Hello everybody and welcome back to Let's Play Paper Mario. This is episode 35, I'm Xenogeno Matt. And last time we made our way through the Crystal Palace and we got to this room here. I got a feeling a big fight is coming up. So let's make sure we're prepared, we got our badges ready. Let's see, for this fight I think I'm going to go with... Paracarry. Let's head through the door. Really love the background of this room and the overall aesthetic. Who comes to my palace? Mario, you finally arrived. <laughs> I know you believe you can save the Star Spirit, but I'm afraid I won't let you. First, I shall defeat you, then I shall present Bowser with an iced Mario gift. So we got the Crystal King, flanked by three crystal bits, each with one HP. He's got a pretty powerful attack that he uses. He'll shoot the, uh, the crystal bits at you. So I'm going to take care of those with a quick... Oh, he's got some... De he's got a decent amount of defense. But yeah, he'll, sh he'll suck up the crystal bits and then he'll shoot them at Mario. And that's a pretty devastating attack if he actually gets it off. So I'm just going to keep dealing with these guys. Crystal King has two defense. I should have noticed that when I hit him with the first air raid. I was too busy checking to make sure he didn't have spikes for that crown. I missed the timing. Yeah, he'll freeze Mario with that ice beam. This guy's like a Pokemon. Alright, summoning more crystal bits. His other attacks include... Oh, Mario can't move because he just got his movement back. His other attacks include multiplying himself, and he's actually one of the only bosses in the game to be able to heal himself. I missed it again. Oh, I'm so mad. So yeah, when this guy chooses to heal himself, it's a huge... Oh, he's just spawning more of these. I'm gonna run out of FP soon. When he chooses to heal, he does for like, I want to say it's 20, I'm hoping it's not 30, but it might be 30, and he can do it up to three times in a, aha, not that time, up to three times during the uh, match, or fight, I should say. Um, I'm good for one more hit. He's easily the most difficult boss we've faced so far. I can't believe it. <laughs> he did it again! Okay, it's only 20, but still. Where does that leave him? 52 HP. He could do that up to three times, so he can heal up to 60 damage. He started out with 70, so he can realistically have 130 HP in this fight. Alright, I think now's the time to use a shooting star. I want to conserve what FP I have just in case of emergencies. Okay, he's clapping me pretty, pretty hard. Uh, Alright, he's back. See, that's why, here's the emergency. I can't use items because Mario doesn't have a turn. But I have enough to use Air Raid. Okay, if I don't defend... This is bad. Oh my gosh. Alright. I need... Oh my... Is that it? Is this loss? What can I do here? Mario's in peril. I don't have any FP. I 
I should have been using Watt the whole time. He's gonna choose to multiply himself. I don't have any FP though. Mario doesn't have a turn. Alright, I need to get lucky. Alright, one in three chance. Okay. Miss. <laughs> oh my gosh. Alright, smooch. Yeah, but I... I should have been a lot more careful this fight. Oh my gosh. Heals again. Okay. Whew. That's a lot... A lot off of my back right now. Uh... Chug down a maple syrup. Get some FP back. And just keep... Turbo Dash in that guy. Okay, so he's gonna elevate and split once more. So I've got a good chance of hitting him. Do I have any more shooting star? I don't. Okay. Alright, last time it was the middle. Let's start with the one right here. It's not him. How about you? Hoo-hoo. Nice. If you don't hit him, then... Ooh. Aha. The three of them will do a coordinated ice attack. Ice beam. I think it might be slightly more powerful than his standard one. And I really don't want to get hit by that. It's going to separate once again. Last time it was in the back. Let's see if I can get it with... A Mario jump. If not, I don't think I want to take the risk of getting hit by that. Okay. Alright, for the record, I would have hit the one in the front. So if he's in the back, this was definitely a good play. This was a great play. Okay. Alright, defending those... Oh, I did have a life shroom, so I guess it wouldn't have been game over, but still. I'm glad I won't have to use that, at least right now, right yet. Be separating one last time. I've got four FP. Can I hit? There must be some move that I have in my arsenal that can hit at least two of them if I don't get it right here. Okay, do I have something that can hit multiple people with just 4 FP? Multiple airborne enemies. Sushi? I don't have Tidal Wave yet. Squirt, great for fire enemies. That single target, that single target. Water Block increases Mario's defense. That could be good, and just in case. Lackalester's got Spiny Surge at all enemies. Excellent. Nice. Though it didn't do that much damage, I got him knocked out of the air. Right, it's not enough to bring him down just yet. It was enough to bring him down. I could have used Skolar. It's got one HP. Don't heal up. Okay, that's fine. Wow. This was closer than I liked it, than I would have liked it to be. All right, for the record, I'm gonna say it's the one in the middle. But this should do it. Hello once again, Skolar. Finish him off, please. I would have been incorrect. Oh no. The last star spirit, King Bowser, forgive me. I don't think this music should be playing right now. Wait. 
This is the music for encountering him. I don't think it should be playing. Right? I don't know why I healed. But if I go back in the room, it should be silent, right? Yeah. Weird. Okay. Anyway, let's grab our last star spirit. Mario has saved the last star spirit, Kalmar, from the Crystal Palace at the edge of the world. Now, with the seven star spirits together, he has the power to challenge Bowser and the Star Rod. At last, it is time for Mario's showdown with evil King Bowser. Can Mario rescue Princess Peach and recover the Star Rod, or will wishes forever go ungranted? Oh, Mario. I wonder what he's doing now. I wish I knew if I was helping him at all. Of course you are. Mario will be fine. You should be proud of your efforts. Mario knows all you've done. And don't you- and don't you worry, princess. You'll be able to talk to him in person before long. Hehehe. <laughs> I hope you're right, Twink. Thanks for cheering me up. Let's go back to the room, shall we? Princess Peach, your cuddly old Bowser's here. Can't we have a friendly conversation for a change? Come on, let me see a smile. I have nothing to say to you. Oh, don't be such a pill. You're stuck with me for a long, long time, beautiful. You'd better get used to it. Mario is coming, Bowser, and you can't stop him. <laughs> oh, you poor silly girl. I'm invincible with the Star Rod, didn't you know? Mario's no match for me. He's history. Get over it. Your raunchiness. We have an emergency. Uh, it better be important. I'm right in the middle of a friendly chat with the princess. Uh, Mario has now saved all the star spirits. There is a chance he could be- he could come here using their power. We must make ourselves ready in case he shows up. What? Uh, Mario! Okay, listen, Gami Koopa, send everyone to their posts. We'll ambush him the second he enters my castle. Princess Peach, why don't you come with me to watch? You can have a front row seat to get Mario- to see Mario get crushed. You, yeah you, tie her up immediately. If she gets out this time, heads will roll. No, please. You- you big Koopa, show some respect to the princess. What is this whining little glittering thing? Confetti? Gah, buzz off. Twing! Take the princess! Now! Let's move! No! My name is Kalmar. Mario, well done. Thank you for coming. You have successfully rescued all of us star spirits. We are in your debt. Now all that is left for you to challenge... Wait, now all is... Now all that is left is for you to challenge Bowser. My power should help you to bring back the Star Rod, to beat Bowser, to bring peace back to the Mushroom Kingdom, and to save Princess Peach. It took me so long to realize I think that's a mustache on Kalmar's face. I always thought he was like perpetually just very sad. Mario's star energy goes up to seven. Mario can now use Up and Away, a new star spirit power. With Up and Away, you can turn all enemies into stars. Mario, you must make your way back to Shooting Star Summit. From Shooting Star Summit will prepare the route to Star Haven. The name of this route is Star Way. Once you travel the Star Way, 
you'll finally reach Star Haven. My only wish is for you to save the precious world. You can do it, Mario. Goodbye for now. Alrighty, we've saved all seven Star Spirits. And I've healed the second time that I didn't need to. Let's head back down Shiver Mountain, through Shiver Snowfield. Ooh, I could take all of these now. No one shall come back to Crystal Palace. I want the snowman. I shall accept the gift of shooting star. Ooh! Almost had me there. second frost piranha there was very aloof. And with that, I believe we're back at the entrance to Shiver Mountain. Goodbye, fellow snowmen. I guess, I shouldn't say fellow. I mean, it's not like we are snowmen. Ooh. Junior Troopa is gone, and in his place are a couple gulpits. So I'm sure... We haven't seen the last of him. And I sure hope we haven't seen the last of these penguins. Bumpties! <laughs> what do you say? How are you holding up? I'd fight for peace and justice too, you know. In Shiver City. It's a very loud car. Good luck saving the world. I should have given him like a Brock Swanson voice. Just like, Hey, Peter. I'm here in Shiver City. It's a terrible impression, I'm, I'm sorry. Wait, who did I say? Did I say Brock Sampson or Brock Swanson? Did I combine Joe Swanson and Brock Sampson? Anyway, <laughs> back, back through Toad Town Tunnels. I ignore me. Excuse me, good hermit. What does he think? I had to blow a hole in the wall to get to him. How insane is he? Also, I've been neglecting the Lil Oinks ever since I got back from Lava Lava Island, I think. One, two, three, four, five. Yeah, I don't think I hit one when, on, when I was on my way back from Lava Lava. Okay, so this will be for completing chapter five. I can't believe I've, I've neglected the Lil Oinks. Is it a pink Lil Oink? Yep. Here's for chapter six. Got a black little oink. Already have one of those. Here's for chapter seven. Or how many little oinks are in here? Oh yeah, five, right. Woohoo! Whoa! Whoa, hold on, is that a silver one? It is a silver little oink. Look at your silver hide, glistening, glittering in the sunlight. What a gorgeous creature. Yeah, wow. Okay, yeah, that's the second rarest little oink. I'll be right back for them, because I, I ain't done with them. I would like you to cook. Let's cook one of these ultra shrooms we got. And we're going to cook with jam and jelly. To create what is possibly the best Mario item in Paper Mario, the Jelly Ultra. Restores 50 HP and 50 FP. This thing is an absolute beast of food. What do I have in terms of other things? Got some... How many Repel Gels? I have one Repel Gel. I got those three attack items. Let me see if I can clip into this pen. There's a way. I don't I don't want to look it up. Because you can it's something like right on this corner. 
I think I have to like... I can't remember. I think it's like... You have to like jump towards it very specifically and I think you have to tornado jump and then you land on the seam and I think you can get in. Either that or you have to like come at it from an angle and then like clip onto it. I want to look that up. I'm really interested in that. Because I did it once and it helps for getting items but you have to be really good at it to get it consistently. You might not even have to be really good, you might just have to know what to do, and like, practice it a few times. So this pen can hold up to a maximum of 10 little oinks. And like I mentioned earlier, when you spawn in the 11th one, the first one will leave, and they'll leave behind an item. Now the item depends on- at least I think it's 10, it might be 15, but I don't think so? And the item depends all on what type of Lil Oink they are. Alright, here we go. That's right, the gold one has left, and he's left an Ultra Shroom behind. But when you enter the pen, all of the other Lil Oinks will run away. And they're gone, including that silver Lil Oink. I believe the silver Lil Oink drops behind a Jam and Jelly. So... It's sad to see all of them run away, but we've gotten... We've acquired one of the rarest items in the game, and I'm up to... 10 items once again. But I know I'm going to have some items on the way, so what I'm going to do... Is I'm gonna come this way. Because I'll be going all out against Bowser, so I can't... I can't hold back. This is not the store I wanted to go to. They do not have the items I need. Let's check the message board while we're here. Toe Town News. Shiver Sensation. Mario Masters Crystal Palace. Mario went looking went to the sh Shiver region to look for the last star spirit and discover discovered the legendary Crystal Palace at the top of Shiver Mountain. This palace is said to have been built and dedicated to the Star Spirits. Bowser's evil followers, however, had taken it over. Mario put those goons on ice and saved the last Star Spirit. Now, with all of the Star Spirits together, they're on their way to Shooting Star Summit. It's finally time to head for Bowser's Castle. Good luck, Mario. Stars. It's a heart. Now I can draw... I don't know how to pronounce it. It's a musical symbol, I guess. Just music note. I love scribbling. A little toad. It's nice to see that the, the underground message board has been taking, taken over by a small child toad. Oh, who's got maple syrup? Does no one have maple syrup in Toad Town? Do I have anything to claim? Wait. Alright, I'm gonna check in a few items. I'll check in the snowman doll. Let's claim. Oh, I have a jam and jelly! Look at that! I'll claim that. Yeah, this is the item. I suppose there was a stopwatch in there? That happens a lot. I always check in items and then forget to claim them. I was thinking there should be another jam and jelly. Cook with another ultra shroom and jam and jelly. Okay. I think that's going to be it for this episode. Next time on Let's Play Paper Mario, we'll stick around in Toad Town for an episode or two and just take care of some odds and ends here and there. Alright, see you guys then.